Hey, how's it going, Fabian Pompey? This is video number one of my boot camp, uh, three day boot camp series on the three C's of marketing how to create traffic, how to capture leads, and how to convert them to sales. Now, this particular video, we're going to talk about how to create traffic, which is very simple. It's just a lot of times people are saying they have a hard time creating traffic into their online business, network marketing business, or even their personal business. And it's not that it's difficult, it's just the information that you're lacking. So, I'm just going to give you some ways where you can create traffic via paid methods or free methods and you just have to implement it so you can use those recommendations that I tell you today to your business so that way you can benefit from them. So let's just get it started. Alright, so let's start with green. I don't know. I think my black right now. Um, so let's just talk about how to create traffic. I must warn you, right? Alright, chicken scratch. So. I guess they say, like they always say, those who write chicken scratch are always the smartest. I don't know, this is my thoughts, but whatever. Hopefully you can read it. If not, just rewind it. Uh, rewind this video. So let's just talk about how, how to create, create traffic. So that's just basically the main purpose of this video. So let's just talk. There's actually free, free ways. Hopefully you guys can see this. I don't know if you guys can see it. If not, you can hear the, the words that are coming out of my mouth. And there are paid ways. So let's talk basis on the free ways of creating traffic. Uh, there are blogs. Blogs, I love blogs. Um, there are videos to create traffic. Uh, what else? There's Craigslist, classified ads. Craigslist. I think I missed an S, right? Should be an S right here, I think. Craigslist. So, anyways. Um, and what else there is? Oh, social media. Social media. Now, let me just point, you know, talk a little bit on these four, you know, strategies to create traffic into your business. Uh, there are a bunch of other free methods, but these are the ones that I particularly use most of the time in my business. And with blogs, blogs I find is a great way to create traffic. Uh, one reason is that it's the traffic you get is very ultra targeted, and what you're looking is to convert your whatever you're trying to promote. Either if you're trying to recruit people to your business or trying to sell someone, I find when you utilize blogs and as well videos, they, they go um, hand in hand that you're able to actually get laser targeted on your traffic that actually converts to sales. Now with blogging, um, you'll have to, like, let's just give you an example. Um, if you're in a personal business, like let's say you have a tax office. Now let's say you did a, a blog or a video around, I don't know, I'm in Miami, Florida, so the best tax office in Miami, Florida, or something uh, around those type of keywords. Um, you'll do a blog, you'll of course optimize it, SEO optimize it, uh, so that way you can get your, your content to rank on the first page of Google, and that way will create traffic for people that's actually searching for that particular keyword. So this is why I say blogging and videos are the most ultra-targeted you know, traffic to get that converts to leads and sales, is because people are actually looking for you. Now sometimes people might say, you know, it might take a little while um, for you to see results with blogs um, and videos, but you got to look at it in terms of like, you know, real estate. These are the assets that you're, the content, because you know, content is king. These are assets that you're putting out into the internet that will continue to bring you traffic leads and sell to your business once you put those content out there. So this is why I love blogs and videos and I find it very crucial if you're looking to get ultra targeted on your traffic and that's, that will convert to leads and sales. Uh, what else can I say about blogs and videos? Yeah, the only thing you just need to know how to, because if you're saying that you know you want that instant results, if you know how to properly optimize it, you're able to create traffic much sooner than later if you know how to you know optimize it. Another thing, a great strategy, uh, Craigslist. Now with Craigslist, I'm, I'm, I'm very good, big on, like I already know how to work Craigslist, but a lot of times people find it difficult to post their ads on Craigslist because they either got their ad, their ads are getting ghosted or flagged. And I'm 
it's basically all in the way you're doing it because there's just probably just a little bit of strategy that you're, you're just missing information that you just do not know so that way you can get your ads to stick and sometimes people feel that um, Craigslist leads or in traffic are low quality um, and honestly it's all in the way you market to them just like with um, paid advertising paid advertisement and blogs and videos it's like the way you market to them with blogs and videos you're giving value becoming more personable to people they see that you're real um, because they can see you and they can read your content with Craigslist you just have to warm up to them a little differently as far as providing them value and as well giving them uh, what they're looking for because you know you gotta understand with Craigslist their, their mindset is like they're looking for work they're in a job mentality so now what you will have to do is probably in the way that you you're emailing to them so you have to basically weed them away from that job mentality and make them understand that there's another way to create um, a great amount of income online so it's all I believe in the way that you're marketing to them as far as sending out your emails to them but it's another great way where you can create tremendous amount of traffic into your business I've, I've had several I've heard of actually several leaders um, that doing like six figures um, in this industry that came from Craigslist, from someone posting an ad and they've seen it and they've gone out to make tremendous um, several thousand dollars um, in, on the internet. Another great way to create traffic, social media, um, I want you guys to understand this is free methods that I'm talking about. Um, social media like Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, all these social media platforms I find is another great way to create traffic to your business. Now you gotta understand. All right, we're we're becoming more digital. We're in the information age, and right, right now, what's trending is social media. And if you're on, if you have a personal business or online, you know, business or network marketing business, you will have to follow follow the trends that's going on, or you'll be left behind. And one trend that is basically, you know, I, I would say it's a big trend right now is with social media, like Facebook. Um, you know. Like if you're if you have a personal business, you can create a fan page because you know social media it actually be, makes you create your online presence. Like get yourself out there. You want people to see what you're promoting, or you want you want people to join you. But social media is a great platform where you can actually create an online presence and as well create traffic to your business. Another great um, other site, um, a social media platform is Instagram. Like showing pictures of of your business or or yourself or your life or anything in general but I find that social media is, is, is free way to get yourself out there it may take a while in a way that you market it but of course if you market it correctly like I have a training um, if you how would I put if you click the link below there's a video that gives you step-by-step -step training on how to utilize either free and paid method you can easily just click the link below so you can get the step-by-step -step training on how to maximize these um, free and paid methods but I find to create traffic to your business, these are from my personal experience, what I'm using, and it's creating a lot of traffic and leads and sales to my business. And if you're on a budget, so I find that you can stick with free methods for now until you're able to get your sales from utilizing these systems, and that way you can go back, go into paid, so that we can increase your results much faster. So like some of the paid ways, Okay, let's just, um, some of the paid ways are solo ads, um, there's PPC, what else, there's banner ads, and co-ops. These are all paid ways where, because a lot of times some people, they don't have the patience, right? They don't have the patience to wait for their traffic, they want that instant um, traffic coming into their business. and. Paid is the, a, a way to go. If you have the money, go towards paid. And but just be careful um, on who you're 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 paying your your income to, and understand that if you don't know what you're doing, you might find yourself wasting a lot of money. So it's better that you um, go to uh, experts into the, in that those specific fields that actually created a huge success. You know, utilizing the paid methods, and like we like I said before, our trainings we have six-figure owners, millionaires that's actually teaching you on these concepts so 
you can Google or YouTube if you like, but me personally, I'd rather you know, listen to millionaires and six-figure earners that's actually utilizing it and showing me the step-by-step strategy on exactly how they did it. So you can always just click the link below to get access, or if, you're, if it's coming from my email, you can always go to the email and click the link there. But with solo ads, I like solo ads because it's, it's it, you know, it's instance, you just, you go, you, you search for a solo ad provider. Um, they either can create the email. Like, for those of you that don't know what solo ad is, it's basically where you go to a solo ad provider that has a huge list. And what you do is you email them, or actually the solo ad provider emails their particular list with the, your particular company's website or a capture page if you're, or, or whatnot, and they actually pay you based on certain clicks amounts that they charge. Like, they have probably 100 clicks for several um, income, um, 200 clicks. It's basically based on how many times people actually click on your particular website. So it's a great way where you can get instant traffic. Just make sure. One thing um, you need to understand with solo ads, like, yes, there's a bunch of solo ad providers out there, but make sure if you're, like, um, in online or network marketing looking for people to join you in your business, um, make sure that you're targeting your, the solo ad provider actually provides buyers lists. And the reason why I say buyers lists is because you're looking for people that's already bought in the Internet already. So if a solo ad provider provides you a buyer's list, you have a higher chance of getting conversion as far as if just randomly getting other leads from probably from overseas and whatnot. So make sure they're geo-targeted. I, me personally, make sure the solo ad provider provides geo-targeted, like from USA, um, Canada, UK, Australia. Uh, find a solo ad provider that provides those and it's also geo-targeted and as well they have a buyer's list and pay them um, based on those um, type of concepts because it's much of a, a better chance for you to get conversions into your business. PPC, uh, pay-per-click. Um, basically, like pay-per-click based on how many times someone clicks on your particular advertisement. Now, there's Facebook PPC, which I really love. Um, and as well as being advertisements, um, like, you know, you, you just got to test it out, honestly. Like, you can either learn from the training to provide you or just learn on yourself. But just if you're looking, if you have that extra money to put out there uh, to test things out. But pay-per-click is another way where you can get targeted. Like with Facebook PPC, you can actually get ultra-targeted in the audience you're going after because you're not looking to market to everyone. You're looking to get specific on the audience you're trying to go after. And there's, there's like, you know, strategies where there's actually tools where you can actually target specific niche. Like if you're, like, in a, if you have a flower shop, you can actually, like, um, go out and probably target to people that's in cemetery, you know, that actually owns a funeral home. There's ways where you can utilize tools. I'm not going to get into that, but with uh, Facebook PPC, that I know of ways where you can actually do that and get ultra targeted on the audience you're going after. Same thing with being advertisement. So PPC is another great way to create traffic. Banner ads, another another great way where you can actually go after you know blogs or businesses that actually are, are already creating a high traffic into their website, then all you do is asking for a space, on, basically renting a space on their website for like a month or however they set it out. So because they're already getting traffic, you'll just have your advertisement there where people can click because they're already getting a high amount of traffic and you have your banner ads and they'll be able to click on it so that we can create more traffic to your business. Co-ops, uh, another great way, but just be careful um, who you purchase your co-ops from. It's just you providing your website to um, someone that has a co-op, and it's just driving traffic to your particular website, um, so that way it's more, you know, faster. You don't have to do all the hard work on understanding how to, you know, get traffic and stuff like that. They actually done everything for you. All you have to do is just provide your website, and they drive traffic to your business or your capture page or however you want to do it. So basically, that's just my experience and way and strategies that I've, I've utilized um, into my business, created a huge amount of success as far as creating traffic to my business, making me get leads and sales. 
So these are basically three ways um, right here, blogs, videos, credit, social media. And there's also paid ways, solo ads, PPC, banner ads, co-ops. There's a whole list of ways. These are just my main strategies that I, I like tapping into when it comes to free or paid methods. And you can utilize the same thing to create traffic into your online network marketing or personal business. Once again, if you're looking for more specifics on as far as over-the-shoulder trainings where you can actually see how to maximize each of these strategies, you can always go back to my emails and click on the link that you see over there so that way you can get over-the-shoulder type of strategies. So that way you can save on money and as well know how to maximize your time when it comes to free methods. So that's it for you guys. Um, check out for my next video on how to capture leads. This is just the first video series on how to create traffic, which is the first C of the three C's of marketing. So take care. All right, take care. Bye.